A motorcyclist who lost his leg in an accident at Port Kennedy almost two years ago has been reunited with the paramedics who saved him. The ambulance officers admit they thought Mark Daniels wouldn't survive, but the determined 24-year-old has made a remarkable recovery and now wants to take on the Paralympics. The last time Mark Daniels was with these paramedics, he was fighting for his life. Hey, mate, how you doing? Nice. Thank you so much. Yeah, nice. oh, no, I can't, can't thank you guys enough. And they didn't think he would survive. Just so many broken pieces, arms, legs and chest, that it was, it was impossible to really, and it wasn't until he really took a breath that I knew he was alive. On the 17th of December 2015, Mark was hit by a car as he rode his motorbike on Port Kennedy Drive. Passing drivers called for help. Are there any obvious injuries? Yeah, his leg. His leg, OK. Is there any serious yeah. bleeding? Um, yeah, his, his leg is. When it arrived, he was lying in the dirt, barely conscious. So I remember your voice from, like, the whole thing. It's weird. He held on to life all the way to Royal Perth. <laughs> You're going to see people who are critically ill. They're as ill as him is the only way I could describe that. But even when it looked grim, they refused to give up. How do you thank someone for saving your life? I don't think you can ever really put that into words. So serious were his injuries, his lower leg was amputated to below his knee. Then his knee had to be removed. It's Mark's determination to recover that's seen him come this far and he's made it his mission to help others by sharing his story. He wants his experience to be a warning to other road users. All it takes is 30 seconds for someone's life to change. In my instance, it was 10 seconds. The guy for 10 seconds didn't pay attention and that's all it was. Alexandra Ristway, 7 News. Quinana Freeway brought to a stand...